Close to 100 people packed the Brothel Rowing Club last Thursday evening to honor Olympic silver medalist Conlon McCabe as part of the city's Conlon McCabe Day, August 23rd. There were brief comments by Brothel Mayor David Henderson, Leeds Granville MPP Steve Clark, and Brothel Rowing Club head coach Chris Marshall, followed by Conlon McCabe himself. You'll never realize just how much impact you've had on so many people here, but it's amazing what you can do with a lot of hard work, and I think Whenever we've talked about what's been done here, the biggest emphasis has been on what you can do with hard work. Because the silver medal just recognizes what you've done. I just want to say what a tremendous role model you are for the young people uh, in this community and in our area. And just how uh, of tremendous the Brockville Rowing Club has been to produce so many world-class rowers. And the highest uh, individual award that we have in this program is, uh, is a trophy named um, after my father and uh, it's affectionately known as the Humphrey. The trophy is presented annually at the end of each summer racing season and will be presented to a BRC rower in good standing that exhibits the following qualities. And they are leadership, initiative, teamwork, dedication, determination, and common sense and common sense is the hard one. Um, this trophy will remain in the BRC trophy case and uh, the winner shall have his or her name engraved on and will receive an engraved keeper trophy as a keepsake. The coaching staff will select the recipient of this trophy and members of the Marshall family shall make the presentation of the trophy. Then I gotta thank all of you guys right here for coming out and supporting me. It, it means the world to me to keep receiving amazing receptions like this and to just have so many great people to always have my back. In, uh, in my lowest moment in the Olympics, when we lost the heats and came dead last by a long shot, one of the first things I thought was, oh, I hope nobody in Brockville saw that. <laughs> I have a pretty good feeling a lot of you were watching. <laughs> but, well, we turned it around in the end. And I'm happy to hear from who I've talked to that nobody jumped ship and everybody still believed in me. And that means a lot to me. I see a lot of younger rowers back here in the back. And I don't know if you guys got to meet Chris's father, but he was a pretty amazing guy for sure. Uh, the last words that he said to us before we went off to school were to always remember where you come from. And that's very true, and I take those words very seriously, that no matter where you go in the world and what you do, whether it's rowing or some other sport, remember where you come from, because the years you spend in Brockville and at the Brockville Rowing Club are going to shape you and make you who you are for the rest of your life. So that's all I have to say. The crowd had a chance to view the silver medal race with a special twist of having the audio from the rowers added. The event wrapped up with the people in attendance getting their photos taken with Conlon and his silver medal. In Brockville, Dale Elliott, BNTV News.